Okay. Um, hi, I'm Dominic Chapman. I'm head of IT at uh, Brockenhurst College. And I'm going to talk about some of the things that we've done with our A2 ICT A level and how we've been able to improve our coursework results. Um, we started off from a point where the uh, students have to produce a technical project, a database project each year, which um, requires them to teach a level of technical skills. And what we found was that we were spending a lot of time in the classroom actually teaching the, the skills which the students needed to know. Uh, we came up with the idea of video casting really initially to try and reduce the amount of teaching time that we had to put into it. Um, and the approach was quite simple. Uh, all the students produce different projects but they all have to learn the same set of core skills. So we produced a series of videos which um, allowed uh, me as a teacher to uh, record what I was doing on the screen along with the narration uh, on a whole variety of different subjects to allow the students to use that in place of me doing a teacher-led session. Um, the effect that this had which uh, we initially did to try and reduce our teaching time was actually a lot more dramatic than we realised. Um, firstly, the students absolutely loved this way of, of doing it. It gave them a lot more flexibility in what they were doing, uh, particularly as we were able to place the videos onto our VLE so that they were able to access from home. Um, what it meant was, was that the students were able to work on their solutions independently and were able to use the videos as tuition. So instead of having to follow a teacher-led session and then sometime later, maybe days later, try and remember what was done, um, immediately everything that they needed to learn was, was encapsulated in the video. Um, for us as teachers, the effect was dramatic. The amount of time that we spent having to reduce, uh, to, to, to actually talk about technical items reduced by something in the region of 90 to 95 percent. Um, and, and that was really the key to this. The students really loved it, but because we weren't having to go back and teach technical skills several times over, it enabled us to concentrate on uh, doing the things which really add the value to the students and helping them maximise the marks from their coursework. The upshot of that is that we've seen a, a big improvement in the coursework marks for uh, the A2 students that have been put through uh, using this method. Um, we had uh, around about 76% of our students score A and B grades for their coursework project this year. Um, to put that into context, only about 23% of those students um, have predicted grades at A and B, so we've seen a big difference between actual achievement on the coursework and, and predicted achievement. Um, whereas that's not entirely down to, to, to the video casting, it certainly meant that um, the students have, um, have learned more because they're able to work more independently. But I think the key is that it's given us more time uh, to spend where we can genuinely add value to get the students through uh, with the best possible marks. Um, the other great advantage is, is that now that we've done it, um, it's there for next year's cohort, so it's going to save us a lot of time in terms of producing uh, future future work. Okay. Um, the impact that we've had overall, um, certainly in terms of me as a teacher and the teaching team that I work with, um, it's meant that we have been able to reduce the amount of time that we're spending doing work and focus on the more important items. Um, for the students it's certainly been more fun, um, they've been able to work more independently and also for those students that miss lessons, um, they're not uh, disadvantaged in any way because the learning is there for them to pick up and use whenever they wish.